Good morning everyone. How are we? I'm pretty good. It is day two, Friday, in DC. And I just thought I'd fill in what happened last night. Now, you would have seen um, all the footage of being on the um, on the bus, going around checking out all the monuments and everything else, and when we were up at uh, Abe Lincoln's memorial and stuff. I actually got a Uber home after that because I was just too hot. I was just so hot. <laughs> I was literally like thought I was gonna pass out. I'm just not used to this heat. The the heat's not bad, but it's the humidity, which is the, like it's just it's just so bad. So <laughs> um, I got I got <clears throat> I got an Uber back last night, and getting in that car of AC was just like happiest moment ever. I was like, dude, I've you've no idea how much this I appreciate. I appreciate this. Um, so then I came back to the hotel and kind of like bumped into some people. I uh, started talking. And a couple of the girls who were on the tour with me, like, got back, and they were back way early. And they came over, and they was like, you won't believe what happened. And I was like, go on. And apparently the um, the tour guide, the guy who was, like, showing us around and stuff, like, kicked off at everyone majorly. He's like, you've got, you know, no respect, no one's listening to me. And it, it just pretty much, like, had a go at everyone. So they were just like, we aren't having this. So they walked off. Um, so yeah, it looks like I made a lucky escape when I did. The guy was kind of, I don't know, it just might have been a bad day for him. But it kind of kicked off and so I got off while I did, which is kind of a good thing. Uh, then I came back and then I bumped into, um, you know, like I said, a couple people. I was just chatting till late. And, and then today we've got the NAF uh, walk, which we're going to walk on Capitol Hill. Uh, I am running a bit late. By a bit late, I mean a bit late and I still need to get some food and things uh, so we're gonna go and meet up with everyone else and go on the walk there's also which I found out on the tour last night which I really want to go and check out today is there is like a Native American museum and there is the uh, National Aviation um, building with all like the plane that crossed the Atlantic um, Everyone who's American watching this will be kicking off me not knowing what I'm on about, but I'm English, I don't know, so I apologize. So we're gonna go and check that out today as well. Um, and then tonight we're on about going to a baseball game, which should be pretty fun. Um, I have no idea how baseball works, but I'm up for seeing how it works. So we might be gonna do that. The reason why I'm kinda like filling you guys in like this is because uh, I've had a word with a couple people from the organization and the, in some scenarios they're going to be okay with me filming but for the rest of the time they'd appreciate if I wasn't to film around everyone because not everyone is as comfortable as me um, like being on camera and being filmed especially like um, you know this weekend is all about empowerment and kind of like you being who you are and it's kind of like for the first time uh, for some people it's like the first time of them like having the wigs off, all the hats off and like showing their alopecia to everyone else so they don't really want some guy sticking a camera in the face and making them feel awkward and weird and stuff so I, I definitely don't want to do that, that's not what it's about um, so I will film what I can um, and otherwise I will just do this, I will just fill you guys completely in of what's been happening during the day because I don't want to upset anyone, I'm completely up for being respectful and all that stuff but I'll show you something funny before we move on today and go and get some breakfast um, my hotel room oh my no, your face is a bit red today Tom just being out of the shower anyway uh, speaking of that I just got out of the shower getting changed and then uh, I suddenly realized that what I saw yesterday the massive office block the people working like there's a dude on his phone right there and I was just like getting changed and I was like realized like oh maybe I should shut the curtains because everyone in the office is just there chilling so I'm gonna put the camera down now because the guy's kind of staring at me he's like who's this guy what's he what's he filming and everything else so I'm gonna go get some food and then I need some water it's so humid over here I just need some water and uh, yeah we're gonna go and check out the museum so I should be fine for filming there I can show you guys around and then Saturday and Sunday are like the seminars, um, which I'm really, really, really excited for. Um, and yeah.
Morning everyone, it is day, what day are we on? Saturday. Is that day three? Okay, on Wednesday, it's Saturday. I have no idea. <laughs> My brain is still so mush. Uh, I don't know if I've still, I can't still have jet lag. I think it's just like the temperature and the time difference is just kind of like messing with me a little bit. But anyway, enough of that. AC's just come on, so it's good. So let me fill in what happened yesterday. You guys saw the footage and I went to the American Indian Museum in DC and it was amazing. Like literally I was blown away. So much history. I was just, it was just incredible. I just spent like a good like three, four hours just wandering around in the museum, reading, uh, reading, um, checking out artifacts, exhibits, all that kind of thing. It was fascinating. I'm so, so happy that I went. Um, so yeah, I did that yesterday, and then <clears throat> I came back and I met up with some of the people, and we did a um, kind of like a workshop, and it was to do with um, being kind of like a mentor for um, younger people with alopecia, which I found really fascinating. So we're all kind of like grouped together, and it's kind of like. Um, Kind of like getting ideas together about how we do this and set up a network and that kind of thing so that was really 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 fascinating we were just like all just chatting for like an hour and a half just like talking about it all and um and they just kind of like hung out last night and it's so good like on an evening like, like everyone's just dotted about and you know it, everyone's just super friendly just like walk up to them and just you know spark up a conversation and it's just it's such an incredible thing it's just it's so weird like you just like just like, oh how are you doing and it's like you know mm -hmm. um oh i got this yesterday from rob uh, villanueva his um brother's like um an nba basketball player and they've got this uh company called uh, alopecia apparel, apparel. Uh, he gave him his t-shirt saying what is alopecia which i think is really cool so i'm going to be rocking that i did rock it yesterday so I'm gonna wear, I'm gonna wear my Keep It Bright T-shirt today, um, showing some positivity, and it, it's a white T-shirt, and I'm gonna melt the lights. <laughs> so today there is loads of seminars going on. Um, I I'm gonna turn my camera down. I'm gonna see if I can film a few of them. I know everyone's kind of a bit like, you know, maybe you know, it's not the best idea to do because, like I said before, not everyone's very comfortable with being on camera and such. So. I'll try and do that, and if not, I'll just do this again. I'll just relay back to you guys what I've done throughout the day. Um, and then there's like an 80s party tonight, which is like interesting. I'm not really like a massive 80s fan. I was born in 89. I don't remember much of the 80s. <laughs> but um, yeah, that should be pretty cool. Just like meet together, mingle, all that kind of stuff. But for now, uh, have I said everything I wanted to say? Yes, probably. So I'm going to head downstairs, get some food, because I'm kind of late again. It's like nearly 10 o'clock, and the, the first conference thing was like 8 a.m., and just the time zone thing is just like messing me up so bad. I'm like falling asleep at like 7 o'clock here, because obviously it's like 1 o'clock at home. Um, yeah, 1 in the morning at home. I'm still not used to it. Probably the last day I'll get used to it, and then I've got to fly back and get back on normal time. But that's enough of me talking. I'm going to get downstairs, get some food and um, say hello to some people. Hi guys, and today we have come to the Natural History Museum in Washington DC. Uh, we're just going to a bit of a dark bit now, I think it's all about like Neanderthals and stuff like that. I don't know how much battery I've got left or how much you guys will be able to see today, but I'll try and capture as much as I can. I'm gonna walk around in front of people. Hey guys, I am in Union Station right now. This place is absolutely incredible. Like, I don't know how long this battery is gonna last. I really hope it's gonna last long enough to show you guys. But look at this, like, I am such, I was such a bad camera angle. Okay, let's try this again. Take two, okay? I mean, look at this in here. It's absolutely gorgeous. Like, the skill of it is just incredible. Um, we actually came in here for some food um, and we've got like a party on later on, which is gonna be awesome. 
but it's just incredible in here. I just want to show you, you guys like what it is actually like and I'm just breathtaking like it's so beautiful in here um, and I'm gonna do some more vlogging tomorrow when I've got battery because so currently at the moment this might die at any second so I'm just trying to get in what I can while I can uh, we've got a big uh, like 80s party later everyone's getting together dressing up it's gonna be cool we'll get to meet loads of different people and uh, the camera's gonna probably die so we'll catch you guys tomorrow